babies or family or nothing. For a woman, our duty in life is to get married, is to have children and to have the next generation going. But nowadays, modern women think their main mission is to work and to pay bills and to succeed and have a career. You see, I totally disagree with this equality solution to things because equality, it breaks them because everybody goes to work now and have to provide for themselves. Do I think women need to be respected as much as men? Yes. But in equality, women leave their babies, their children in daycare and kindergarten and strangers are raising them. So in my opinion, women have to get back to feminine energy and do their main duty is to raise family, to raise children, to be at home. And when they have extra time, they have two, three hours left. Now they can do whatever they want, pursue their purpose. Maybe they want to paint. Maybe they want to sing. Maybe they want to be an architect, whatever that they want, as long as they're not bringing stress home. And let's be honest, if a woman works 40 hours a week, it's impossible for her to keep love for a husband and children. And so she is depleted and everybody is depleted. Women do not belong in the workplace like men. In this modern society, as women are working and they're becoming masculine, men are becoming more and more, excuse my language, lazy and feminine because women are providing. And then why men would be motivated to provide for her? Men want to provide and protect a woman who is gentle, who is kind, who is loyal, who is feminine, who gives him love. And love, I mean not sex, literally the energy of love. When she appreciates him, when she nurtures him, when she cooks for him, when she cooks for her kids, and not this $5 boxes that you buy in Whole Foods and put them in the microwave and, and serving family. I mean the homemade meals. And so that's why I am for harmony between man and woman, woman being feminine and man being muscular. And so many women are saying, I still can be feminine if I work 40 hours a week. That's a fantasy. A woman, I've tried to work six hours a week and I still were not 100% feminine. Maybe 20, 30% feminine, but 70% my brain was still functioning and I was exhausted. And so my friends, we have to decide if you're working towards femininity, you got to start detaching slow by slowly of work and start learning how to depend on man, how to respect him so he can provide and protect. But if you want to work and think that you can be feminine and for your husband or boyfriend to provide and protect, that's not going to happen. You cannot have both. You cannot chase both rabbits and hoping that you can have both worlds. One or another. If you decide that you want to be successful, rich, and independent, then a feminine path is not for you. And if you decide that it's your path to be feminine and have a husband to provide for you, then you got to let go and start detaching from work. So I hope I answered that question. And I know this topic typically triggers a lot of feelings, but let's be calm. This is just my opinion. If again, equality works for you and you decide to work 40 hours a week, I wish you well. It's not that it's wrong. It just doesn't work for me. And I see that it doesn't work for two and a half thousand clients that I work with in the past 19 years. And I'm just sharing my experience. But the choice is yours, my friends. I'm not making anybody wrong.